Hello everybody, Georgia Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. This card is for my card pal, Sam. Um, for the month of July, the colour is brown, so I'm going to change it up a bit to brown. I'm going to use the stamp set um, Free as a Bird, and I'm going to use that image, the leaves and the little flower. Um, the what do you call it? This shape here is the dies that go with the free as a bird, and that's these. So you get four, eight of these shapes and a straight one to make it stitched around the edge. But I'm not going to do stitch around the edge because I cannot lift my um, big sharp. And that was the only thing I didn't do. I have cut out my shape and yeah, that's right. And I've also put it through the embossing folder. This one, I think this is actually retired, but I've done that. I put it through this embossing folder. Can you see it? Yeah, so I've done that. The doily on the back is, I cut out loads and loads of doilies ages ago. I found them when I was having a sort out. And there was this one, a couple of more white ones I've used. And that green one. That's, um. oh, what's that? Mossy Meadow. No, I think this one here is um, always artichoke, but I put it with Mossy Meadow cardstock. And here I've got an early expresso one, which I'm going to use because the card base is going to be early expresso, and I've used half an A4, cut it four and one eighth, and folded it in half. I've also got a piece of crumb cake. Uh, five and five eighths by three and seven eighths and then I have got this shape which is going to go on top and then the early espresso doily and then obviously the birds I have cut out a tiny got a smaller one out actually but that's all right because I only want the word hello stamped in there and a scrap of early espresso to cut a board around which will do and last month, Card Pal, I sent her a blue one, which we made online. Um, and this is the one I got from her. I thought I'd show you the cards that she sent me. And she sent me this beautiful centre step card um, with a peacock on. Isn't that pretty? And that's what she sent me. Which opens up, and there was a nice letter inside, and some gems. Oh yes, she sent me some beautiful gems. So, and they're in my box. <laughs> so, that's what we're going to do today. So, to get started, we will, with a scrap, we will stamp our bird, our three little flowers, and two leaves. So with this big stamp and my Versafine I'm going to just stamp that down there more fussy cutting ladies see I don't mind fussy cutting so I must have soap or something in my cloth And then we want two leaves, which 
to there and three of the little flowers which are there. Now I have already cut out these so which I've got there so I don't need to cut them out but I will colour them in for you so that's the black up with some suede put that to dry for a minute and my little sentiment I am going to stamp the word hello and that is in here that is there it's a little tiny hello so I'm just going to hopefully stamp that in the middle that's lovely what's that clean alright on here we are going to stamp, I don't know if you could see it on this, I did leaves and some flowers all around the edges, so that's what I'm going to do, just stamp one in each corner. flower I just put some flowers you won't see half of these because this will be hiding them so we need to bring it out a bit there, put one there, and put one there. And just put one there, just so you can see it. Nice. And that is all our stamping done. So let's colour in this lot. So the branch, I've got loads of gems next to me, not gems, I've got gems on the brain, pens, blends. So old olive light, that's all I seem to do is old olive light for. So the, oh no, might as well do these leaves. I'm no good at the colouring. I'm not going to colour the other one. Um, I'm just going to. That's right. Then, with um, no, bronze, I am going to colour this branch in. Like that. 
and then with soft suede I'm just going over the bits where this shaded where the stamp says it's shaded so I've done that lovely lipstick I'm colouring our flowers in lovely lipstick And these ones I just didn't colour them in properly. Just coloured to the middle. That's all I did there. Maybe a bit there. Another bird I did. Petal pink. For their chest. And I went over it in crumb cake all over the bird. And with soft suede, and we went where it was all shaded. It looks weird. Let's sort this out. That's better. Hmm. And blend that colour in. There we are. And then with Daffodil Delight, we just, if we can get the lid off, do the beaks. And 
and then you cut them all out and you end up with all this lot. So, once we don't need to do that and they're already done, we can put this card together but first we need to sort this sentiment out. Let's stick this on here. Like that. And then get our paper snips and just cut round, leaving a nice delicate border. Ah. That's how easy it was to back that. Only because it's an easy shape to cut round. So let's put this card together. Right, this one on flat. Go inside. I don't think I did anything inside. I shall have a look. Just a sentiment. Right, now we've got this. I we'll glue this onto here, quite high up. And then we glued the birds on like that. in the middle and quickly before it dries pop this one under there and this one under there And I know what else, never put any spring linen thread. Now I've got it out. So, leave that bit there. And we just will rewind it round twice. And Try not in it. Just sort that out in a minute. That's it. And that sentiment will sit on there like that, over here. And these flowers, we also glued them flat. I put one up there, one in the middle there, and one here. Yeah.
And this was put on dimensionals. So I want the large ones. So one there. One on there. off and pop this going to do is put a glue dot down there to hold that down and stick this over the top. some gems to put on it. Find some gems. These were some of the gems I got off Sam and a beautiful book. I don't know if you can see them. Seventy and eighty. Sent me that and a uh, number seventy. Aren't they beautiful? And there's the seventy. There'll be a special card when I have to make them. Just pop three gems, one up here, one here, and one here. Nearly finished them. To find another packet, I'm sure I've got one in the drawer. So there you have it. Hope you like them. Keep moving this mat. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my videos, please subscribe. And if you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually a Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting, and I hope to see you again soon.